about is that the music that we put out is like a message. You know what I mean? Like it's it's a real message, bro. And I feel like when you put out a when you put out a message, you know, it legitly has to be something that. I don't know, for me, it has to be positive, you know what I mean? And I got told that the music that I put out is not pos- it's not what people want to hear. But you know what? Like, legitly, I put music out for myself, you know what I mean? Like, I put it out for me. And, and, and honestly, listening to your music, bro, it sounds like you do, too. Like, yeah, yeah. That's why that's why you definitely deserve to be heard, bro. Like for real. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. <laughs> like, when I be, like how I look at my music, it's like I write how I feel, what I see, things I would like to see, things I would like to experience or where do I see myself in the next ten, five years. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I try to do music beyond just today or beyond tomorrow. Yeah. Like I want I want my music to last for a long time so I put music out that people are going to remember it's going to stain them it's going to be part of them not just something you heard yesterday and that was it you know you're waiting for the next shit to come out yeah. you know what I mean I just want people to just love my music and just just be a part of my journey or where I'm going and try to see the world from my eyes you know what I mean no I do know what you mean bro like I, I ain't gonna lie to you bro I, I did something right now that um <laughs> I got you live right now on the Forest Radio while we having this conversation. And I, because these are the moments that I don't like to forget. You know what I mean? Like, loud bro, like I legitly got us live right now on the Forest Radio. 298 million people done already tapped on their lives, bro. And they listening to this. Like, they listening to us, bro. Like, like that's why I'm like saying like it's so much that that you know like I I learn from people like I I legitly learn from I can learn from you. This is I'm 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 a, I'm a I don't know if you can hear it here, but my play this is like the first person to hear like this is the album right now I'm working. On. Wow, that's that's, that's, that's really right amazing, bro. That one's called uh, True Colors. True like, Colors. Yeah, bro, that's that's really like amazing, bro. Like that's why I said you are a dope artist, bro. Like you legitly dope, bro. Like, well, how long have you been? Like, how long have you been doing music, bro? Um, I, you know what, bro? I never used to do. I never used to take music seriously, you know. Um, I used to just do music for fun. Just playing the studio, just record a song, play it in the house. Yeah. You know what I mean, and my friends had to sit down, we chill. But um, my my family is a music musical family, like really, really musical family. Like, musical okay. Outside of my family, I got we got big artists actually from our family that does music. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, so. It runs in the family as well. My mom, she can DJ. My mom, she can sing. You know, my daddy can rap. You know. Yeah. So it's like it's a music family. You know, I got I got cousins that's been working with French Montana. They work with Jay Z. They work with Beyonce. West Khalifa. They work with Drake. But 
from. Wow. Sometimes you sometimes you're around families that are working with all these people. Yeah. You know, like, and you're just helping. You know what I mean? Like it, like I used to just help. I'd just be sitting in the studio. I'd be recording so many people. Yeah. People have got like thirty million views, forty million views on their song, twenty million views on their song. I've never signed a contract with them, no paperwork. You know what I mean? It's just it's just family doing their stuff. Wow. They're working with artists. And I'm just sitting there like, I love music. Wow. And this is what I want to do. So I'm not really thinking about like the yeah. paperwork side of it. Yo, yo, cause you know I want I want a percentage out of this or, you know what I mean? Like boom, boom, boom. Yeah. But, you know when your family is back, it's family stuff. So love it. So. And you know I'm, what? No, it's <coughs> excuse me for cutting you off, bro. I, you, they, this is what I mean. Like this is why I created the Forge Radio. Like I keep saying this because. Like when I meet when I meet people like you, bro. Like I meet a person like yourself. Like that. Like you just so humble about it. You know what I mean? Like you truly just humble about it, and that's why your music come out like gracefully, like it does, bro. Because what I just heard, like I'm just like, man, I can't wait. People like legitly about to hear you, bro. You know what I mean? Like, they about to hear you, and, like, man, it's just, it's just really, it's just really dope to meet you, bro. Like, I'm not even kidding, because, like, honestly, I, man, bro, like, you. Because I'm telling you, bro, see the album, yeah? Yeah. Bro, cut you, bro I'm telling you, it, like, bro, this, uh, what is it, uh, Deep Thoughts, yeah? So that one was True Colors, yeah? This is Deep Thoughts, yeah? Okay. So Deep Thoughts. I'm gonna hear some of you. I'm here. I'm listening, bro. Yeah, Wow. Can I uh can I play something for you real quick? Yeah, yeah. All right. So this is a track. I'm going to uh cut it down a little bit so I won't play eardrums out, but this is the track that I was telling you about. For the paper, I'm moving every muscle on me, dead ya. Me do it for your heart and that's measure. Uh, baby, all I know, oh, me see is you. Uh, baby, all I know, oh, me see is you. I show you how I hustle for the paper. I'm moving every muscle on me, dead ya. Me do it for your heart and that's measure. What you think about that, bro? That's dope, bro. You like it? <laughs> yeah, that's dope. Man, bro, that mean a lot, bro. For real, like I legitly, like, man, bro, that it it'll legitly be dope if you jumped on that, bro. Like, I'm not even kidding. 
Cause like listening to your music and like hearing your sound, bro. Like you, you definitely got a dope. I definitely it'd be dope to collab with you, man. Like for real. Like, like whenever you got time. Bro, I like I like when it break. I like when it break. No, like. Thank, mean. thank you so much, bro. Like that's. <laughs> I do it for your heart and no wit, man, bro. I. I I got like a whole different sound too. Like I'm gonna send you some links to my my music, bro, so you can check me out too. But yeah, bro, I I definitely. So what what time is it where you are right now? Uh, it's what seven a.m. seven o five. Oh really? Yeah, yeah, in the morning. Oh damn, man! I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> Nah, nah, I'm up anyway, because I got to get, get my daughter ready and shit for school, so. Okay. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm up, you know, I'm up from, like, I've been up for, like, fucking, I even sleep, really. Nah, I'm, man, that's how I am, bro, like, that's really how I am, bro. I, uh, I, I, man, I'm up all night. It's 1 a.m. where I am. Literally. Yeah. Yeah, bro, and it's like I'll be up all night. I literally either doing stuff for the Forge Radio or I'm just like always studying, trying to figure out information how to, you know, to monetize it and and you know just do a good job. I have a magazine too, bro. Yeah, yeah, I have a magazine as well. But you know, like honestly, um, like I said, man, I'm I'm really just I really want to like get a passport. And like come to London one day and meet you or like meet other artists and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Like, um, yeah, whatever, bro. Whatever, bro. whatever, you know, whatever, bro. Yeah, bro. Like I got big dreams, bro. Like for real. And I'm definitely gonna make them happen, bro. That's the wave. That's the wave right there, bro. So I believe in yourself. You know what I mean? Yeah, I bro. Got, like, I got like I got like made some amazing songs, bro. And I would like. There's a lot of people on the ground that fucks with me, like a yeah. lot of people they're blue chick and shit, right? But you know, sometimes I think like people hear your shit and and they will say to me, Yo, I don't know how you do your music or where you do your music or what I know is yo, you got you put love and time and energy in your music and I feel your music. Yeah. But I'm saying, yo, like you feel my music and shit, clearly you got like you got like two million followers and shit. You you follow my shit, like you like my stories when I post my shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? You like my music and shit, but it's like when you're trying to get people to work with you, bro, it's like It's hard. I think people like people look at it as like music is like a competitive thing. Whatever your whatever you're friends with somebody, it's only people that really generally got love in their heart for themselves and love in their heart for other people would really give you a chance like that you know what i mean yeah i do bro i i legitly know exactly what you mean bro because you know like it's this is how i feel bro like i never i never put a ticket on anything for the forest radio you know like yeah i have been doing this for what 11 months now since last march and 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 it's like I'm never a person to have any expectations back at all. Like, not even a little bit. I I just legitly just, I show love. I lead with my heart. And, like, if I feel lead, led to, like, you know, play your music, like, I'm not asking for no money, man. Because, like, I know how it is to be an artist that want their music heard. And then, so, you know, I created a platform where I created it for myself, but then I just started reaching out to artists like yourself. Like, hey, look, I got this platform. I learned how to stream music and also be able to share the app and create those certain things inside the app where I can do it. And that's what happened, bro. Now you like another number like you know of thousands but i i definitely want to stay connected with you know especially with your new album you know what i mean bro like i love music to the point where i just really want to keep continuing connecting with new artists because bro i my goal is to reach out to more artists that's in london bro to reach out to more artists that's in china or somewhere you know what i mean like and and if that 
And if that helps them get hurt and, and somebody to listen to what they doing, bro, then I'm all for it. And and I love to see people happy, like especially when their music is being heard somewhere that they didn't even know that they shit can be reached. And, you know, it's like people out here, man, everything is just about a ticket for them. Like, how much you going to pay me to do this and how much you going to pay me to do that? And it's just like, I'm tired of seeing artists getting exploited by these people that's all over the internet, too. And be and taking advantage of them, bro. <clears throat> like for real, like too many artists is being taken advantage of, and nobody's paying attention to that. And that's why, you know, I legitly just wanted to be that one platform where people can feel safe to send their music and and not, you know, you know that's able to share, bro. That's you know that's why I say you make good music. I'm going to reach out to you and, you know, be like, yo, this is what I want to do for you. You know what I mean? Like, no yeah. bad intentions at all, bro. Like, but you really do make good music, man. I don't mean to be, re- you know, repeat myself, but you definitely do, bro. Nah, man, that's a, that's a blessing, man. That's love, man. No, that's, that's love. You know what I mean? I got, I got, like, I got a song that, um, I got a link, I got a link, um, uh, my management team as well in America, man, like, a D block management team still see what's up man because I got some music and shit like obviously I got like songs with them and stuff like that right right um but uh, I think the album I think they're dropping like an album or a project this year okay so, like some of those songs are gonna be featured on that project you know what I mean okay so I gotta, I gotta wait until they decide when they wanna you know yeah when they yeah. when they wanna do anything with the music because like they don't send me shit I'm like yo cross we need we need a hook in this you know what I mean? Uh, wow, that's that's and cross you know, that bro, that's amazing, bro. Like seriously, like you know, like honestly, this is can can I share with you just like real quick, like what my goal is to do. Like my goal, yeah. is, my goal is to uh, to travel and to meet artists, like you know, like because honestly, like I grew up in New York. I grew up in New York, up in Yonkers, and, like, and stuff like that, and, and, and like, you know, being up in Brooklyn, bro, like, I did, and, but at the same time, like, I moved to Minnesota because I got a wife and children and stuff like that, but one day, I want to, my goal is to travel around the world and to meet new artists, and, connect new artists especially with the forest radio and to you know what i'm saying to be able to you know do that stuff like but you know i i really do this for my children you know what i mean like i do this for my children man like i do this for myself and my children and like uh you know i i've i've been going through some rocky stuff lately you know what i'm saying but like i'm not one of them persons like to be a victim and, you know, when you just, you know, just start having new experiences and stuff like that, like, it make you feel good in some type of way, you know. But my goal for the Forest Radio is to, my goal for the Forest Radio is to create new experiences for me and my children, like, and to, you know, travel the world, bro, and to meet, like, because honestly, bro, like, It'll be dope for me to, like, I, I'm not gaining nothing by taking advantage of artists, bro. Like, I'm really not. And, and that's and that's exactly not what I want to do. And, and you know, I, I appreciate you for even, you know, having a conversation with me, bro, for real. Nah, I mean, you, you, gotta, you gotta socialize, you know what I mean? Can't be like, I think, I think where most artists lack of music or lack of... When you just started out, it's like you're hungry. People can feel you. Yeah. You know what I mean? But when you get to like a certain position, you're comfortable. You're not hungry no more. So it's like the hungriness is gone. Now it's like your mind can't really focus on what needs to be right. You know what I mean? So now you like, you get people to start writing stuff for you. And when they start writing stuff for you, it's not, it's not you. It's not something that's real. It's just something that's made up on a piece of paper and you just go right. and sing it. 
Facts. You know what I mean? So no, I, I feel do. like people should be more open. You know, yeah, you got millions of followers. You know what I mean? But you, got, but these people are there when you started, and these people are gonna be there when you finish. So it's like people share. You're sharing your journey with people. People. Um, accepting your journey and they're following your journey I feel like you should be a bit more obligeable to even talk to your fans you know what I mean yeah you know yeah and you can't talk to everybody you know what I mean but you like everybody texts underneath your post when you push it up on YouTube yeah. they comment they put thumbs up right yeah now you got a platform where you can go live you know you can't talk to millions of followers every day but you can talk to the majority of followers you know what I mean yeah. and just let people know Listen, if you ain't got the time today maybe another day but there's so much people, so I can't really know who to pick on. I'm speaking like on a random person having a conversation. I mean, get the fans and, you know, and, and connect with people, you know what I mean? Yeah, no, I do, bro. <laughs> like, that, and you know, that's, I think that's the ma- amazing part, especially when you, especially when you, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, our distance, <laughs> you know, is it's really dope. You know how social media can work and connect people nowadays. You know what I mean? So, uh, yeah. I, I'm, I'm truly, truly like you know honored and blessed that you know especially that you know I can definitely connect with you, bro. Like seriously, cause like I said, you hit me up, bro. When you hit me back up, I was like, yes. <laughs> I was like, yeah. I was like, yes, because like, bro. When you hear good music, you just, I just was like, damn, I just want to hear more of his music. And, and it's, and it's truly, it's truly special when it comes, like, directly from the artist. Like, when I see that email, yeah. when I see that email come directly from the artist, I'm like, here's my rights right here. Because here's the artist's email, the yeah, date. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. Like, yeah. <laughs> here's that. Here's the rights bit, right you here. Bit, you feel a bit better, you know, because if the artist is actually responding to you, and it's not like for a, real, it's not like a computer, a computerized or nothing like that. You know, what I mean? it's just the artist is actually being genuine and actually yo appreciating. Exactly. Appreciating, you know, <laughs> So you you feel my excitement? That's what I'm saying. Like that's what I'm like. I'm like yes. Like I get to hear more of his music, and then like I've 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 I've, the reason why I always reach out to people and people text me, I always respond back to people. I remember like I done this song. Um, this guy, this guy from America, right? Uh huh. He follow me, follow me on my IG. Uh huh. But I don't know what's wrong with his IG right now because it don't seem like it's working or maybe he lost his phone or something. I don't know. Okay. I don't know him for years, right? Yeah. It's like, he just add me one day. And he just like, yo, he texts me, he's like, yo, I love your music. Your music is inspiring, yo. That shit made me feel different. So I said, yo, pick up yourself, bro. So he said, yo, I, I'm going to make a, I'm gonna make a beat for you. And I said, I said, all right. He sent me the beat. I listened to the beat and I shot him. I said, yo, I'm going to text you back in like, give me like an hour, two hours. Yeah. So I text him back in two hours. I sent a song to him. So I went in the studio, recorded the song. And I'm like a week after I shoot the music video for it. Right? Yeah. And I said, I said yo, um, send me your, your 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 first name, your last name, so I can put you on the uh, thing when I release the music. Yeah. And he said, yo, I don't want nothing from that, bro. I, I just love your music. I appreciate you. I love you, bro. I just want to see you win. He sent me the beat, right? When I check the beat, the beat ain't got no copyright, no nothing on it, right? But yeah. I still put his name. I still put his name. Um, I still put his name, like his, his beat name. Yeah. On the actual paperwork. So right. when I released it, you know, if you don't want nothing in like a couple of years time, you don't know, you might have kids. You never know, so. They might find out, yo, you know, yeah, your dad actually made a beat and the artist actually put it out and he's not big right now, but now he's big and that song's actually, like, you know, actually generated some money, so you'll actually have some money and, yeah. you know, you, know, you that, never know how it turns out, you know? That's, that's, that is, that's real, bro, uh-huh. like, even, like, with the Forest Radio magazine, bro, like, um, what's really great is, like, you know, like, I I started using um this app called WordPress 
um, to yep. to make my magazine. It's because uh, I'm building up like money to uh, to create my own website and like um, I want to make uh, my goal is to uh, my goal is to basically um, create my own app for the Forge Radio. Um, so that, you know, I can, you know, get people to download my app instead of the iHeartRadio app that I'm using. Because, in all truth, bro, like, I have over 400 million downloads for this app, and I haven't got paid by this app at all. But, but at the same time, bro, what's still making me happy is that I still get to meet, like I said, I still get to meet artists like yourself. I actually want to go into radio, and I actually want to be the first radio station that plays, like, you know, like, all artists, like, independent artists, like, live on, like, the, the state's radio. And because right now, the DJs out here, they're picking and choosing what they want to hear, you know what I mean? Like they're picking and choosing like the um they're picking and choosing the music that they want to present because like right now the music that people want to hear is like the shoot 'em up bang bang they don't want to they 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 you know what I'm saying or if it's like a club vibe but honestly bro that's what I'm saying like I have a good ear for music like. And 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 when I hear something great, I'm like, yo, this 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 song can be meant for like this kind of moment. You know what I mean? Like, I have a show March fourth that I'm having here in Minnesota where I got people from around the world that's around the states that's coming to this show. And and like, bro, if you was even here in the states, bro, it'd be dope for you to come. <laughs> like. You know, for I like get, I get invited I get invited to shows all the time. Man. I mean, last year was kinda of, I got invited to a lot of shows last year. Yeah. Um because of the whole COVID shit. Yeah. Man, they bro. Like, yo. They were like, yo, we booked your ticket, we pay for the test. You know what I mean? We give you like seven grand. Yeah. Just to come and perform, just one song, bro. I bet you this I don't say, yo, bro, this time. It's not even about the money, cause it's just I don't want to take no that bloody, you know, that yeah. bloody COVID shit. Yeah, no, now, for they real. They say you, they say no, you didn't really need it, so I, I'm kind of happy that I didn't take it. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, for I real. Like fucking, I was meant to be at a versus show. Yeah, with, uh, D Black and, and Gypsy and them lot. Okay. If if you um if you look at one of Starsky's latest um music video. I, f- I forgot what it's called. I think it was on his mixtape or something that he released. Uh huh. His mixtape released. Um, you see somebody in there. Um, it's called when when the song starts. It will say legendary music. Yeah. Yeah. It will say legendary music. So that's like that's the person that that works with everybody. So that's the person that actually reached out to me from 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 um from D Block. Wow, bro. And that's like, he shot me like yo, bro. You, your your style of music here, yeah, it's like your shit make me feel like I'm listening to um Bobby Rich, oh, right? Damn. But but like with a different, but like with a with a with a like a different like a better like a better tone. Yeah. And I'm like, bro, don't don't say shit like that, bro. Cause like Bobby, Bobby like Bobby Bobby is like one of my. You know what I mean? Bobby Rich is like a, like a good artist. Yeah. Like vocally in the studio and outside the studio, he, he sounds amazing. Really you know what I mean? So it's like somebody that I listen to their music. You know what I mean? And I, somebody you like, have real like respect for, like as an artist, yeah. and and that yeah. that's really and that right there, bro, is the type of stuff that I. That's the type of shit that I love because like. You don't have enough of that, bro. Like, well, people building each other up, like artists building each other up, and like, you know, saying nice stuff like that about each other in the states, bro. Like, everybody is such in competition, like you said. Like, everybody. We, we, 
we we watch it, bro. We 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 watch it over here, and we see what's going on, and um, we see rappers dying. You know what I mean? I'm looking at like, bro, y'all niggas make so much money. Y'all niggas got so much love. Like, yeah, I understand like on both sides they're killing, there's killing on both sides and shit. But you can't get back those people. Yeah. But at the same time, you continuing killing each other on both sides. You still ain't gonna get back none of those people. Right. So even the people that's gonna die same way, those people ain't gonna come back either. So it's like the generation you're gonna keep killing, keep killing, killing, bro. It has to come to a stop. So that's why I respect people like N- NBA Young Boy. Yeah. You know what? Like, like, like yo, fuck what we got. We lo- we lost people on both sides. Yeah. But fuck the violence, bro. Like the violence is not. It's not it. And you know what? That's why. And that's why I have been filtering out the Forest Radio from music because, like, I'm not the one. I'm a suicide counselor, bro. Like, I le- like I legitly been doing it for four years, and I love what I do, man. Like, I legitly love being a suicide counselor because, like, and I'm also about to start working with some other organizations called Feed My Starving Children over here um, in Minnesota like the whole show is about mental health for fundraising and uh, feed my starving children and stuff like that bro and and and, and I really like I really want to inspire people to uh, I really want to inspire people to be able to have a heart you know to lead people in the right direction bro and, and and you know bring nothing but positive stuff like especially with the Forge Radio, like I I wanna be a new DJ. I wanna be a new person who can make a difference and make a change to stuff like that. You know what I mean? Like it. I'm so I'm so tired of like I don't even like on my show, bro. I don't talk about what other people talk about, like the news of. Kill rappers dying and stuff like that because you know why? Because everybody else is doing that. Everybody else is talking about that stuff. Like I don't want to bring no more sadness and burden to people. Like I know it's happening. I know it's going on, but I I choose not to acknowledge it. You know what I mean? I want to bring a different light to people. I want to bring, you know, a new story to people, man, instead of, you know, having people just, you know, just be all stuck on one thing. Because I, I just feel like that there's not a lot of growth, bro, and and I wish people seen that. Like, I really do. I wish they, like, actually seeing what's going on, but they get all this money, and, and then, you know, like, truth be told. I'm not judging, or nor am I hating, bro, you know, like, it's just that I wish they they actually make a change to their neighborhoods than trying to tear down their neighborhoods, man, but that's, that's just me, bro, you know, because if I was in the position, if I was in the position to, you know, like, let's just, I'm just using this example, Say, say you be like, you know what, bro? I'm going to send you to this person. And then I have a conversation with this person. And they give me an opportunity to make a difference. Like, I will, bro. Like, I legitly will. Because I've, you know, just because I'm not in the position right now, I'm in the position that's been giving people exposure. But you know, and do you think I've been salty because nobody else showed love back? No, I haven't. Because, legitly. Well, the point is, 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 the point is, is that's, not what you're, that's not what you're doing it for. It's not, yeah, it's not. It's not to, to uh, feed you back. It's just for people. If people acknowledge and appreciate the love and shit, that's, that's what it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause it's not for the attention, bro. It's never, it's never been for the numbers. It's never been for, it's never been for none of that, bro. Like it's legitly just because I, I legitly just love doing what I'm doing, bro. Like I do. 
I love, like I said, I love meeting new artists like you, bro. Like, because, and having conversations like this. Because, like, legitly, like, this stuff opens up doors. And and people going to listen to this episode. Like, right now, people going to listen to this episode. They going to be like, damn, who is that that you had on the Forge Radio? You know what I mean? And then, when I play your music, that's why I'm, I'm like, bro, like. You have no idea, like, the sound that you have and, like, the, and, and I'm one day, I'm going to get to a place where, where whoever gets pe- played on the Forge Radio, I want to make sure that y'all eat, too, like, let legitly. Me, let, me, let me do this quick before, before this computer dies. No, most um, definitely. <laughs> so, I hit the, hit the front. I'm, I'm going to. Like and you know like and and honestly, bro, like it's le- even legitly that like even meeting you because like, I like I legitly don't care if you even know them people or you know if you didn't. It's just dope to know that you do know them and and that you. Hold on. Okay. okay. This shit right here. Right? This shit's gonna die. <laughs> Oh shit, yeah, it died, man. Ah, damn. I like how it started off, though. <laughs> yeah, that's a script. I, I got bad shit on the release this year. This year, it's all about, um, I gotta release a lot of music videos this year. You know what I mean? But, um, I got my cousins working with me, but it's like, he just keeps letting me down, bro. It's like, he, he says he's gonna shoot the videos for me. Yeah. You know what I mean? But, uh, He's just been kind of lacking, you know what I mean? Yeah, no, I, I understand. I have like two videos done for this year, so in this year, the beginning of the year, I have like two videos and shit, but like, he, it's been time. We ain't shoot nothing on now, so it's like, I'm just waiting, but um, I think I'm just gonna get a video, man. Yeah. Well, because you know what I said to him, it's kind of harder to just budget shit, where music, yeah. videos, music videos cost a lot, you know? Yeah. Do you have a um? Do you have a content creator by chance? Nah, bro. I ain't got shit right now, bro. I'm just like. Well. Just me and my brother reading, you know what I mean? Well, the reason why I ask, you know, do you have a content creator, bro? Because uh, I, you know, I, I definitely want.